everyone, welcome to Eminem Bros. Recognize this book? Yes, because it's Horrid Henry's hilariously horrid joke book. So it's all it's one day till uh, Halloween. So I'm just starting this one day before Halloween. So here we have on page seventy two horrible history howlers. Miss Battleax, where did Napoleon keep his armies? Under his sleeves? Lazy Linda, I wish we lived in the olden days, Miss Battleaxe. Why, Lazy Linda? Then there wouldn't be so much history to learn, Miss Battleaxe. During which battle was Lord Nelson killed? Clever Care, his last one. Miss Battleaxe, what came after the Stone Age and the Bronze Age? Dewey D. Granham, the sausage. How can a sausage come after that? It was the Silver Age or something like that. Miss Battleax, what's the difference between the death rate in Elizabeth times and death rate nowadays? Clever Claire, it's still the same, one death per person. Miss Battleax, who invented factions? Rudy Margaret, Henry VIII. It's like Horrid Henry. And maybe she's describing him as eight years old or something. Maybe that's right. Like, Horrid Henry the eight. She's saying eight because maybe he's eight years old. I don't know. When do Egyptian pyramids have doorbells so you can to come in? Miss Battleaxe. Who was the fastest runner in history? Our Arabatic owl, Adam, because he came first in the human race. Miss Bellux, tell me something important that didn't exist 100 years ago. Me. What? How would Henry is not even important? Something important that didn't. How would Henry doesn't exist? That, why is he saying it? Oh, wait, maybe it is because he hates his life, maybe. Maybe that's why. What's the fastest way to count cows? Using a calculator. It's like calculator but cow calculator. If you had 10p and you asked your dad for another 10p, how much would you have? Anxious Andrew, uh, 10p miss. Miss Patrick, so you don't know your arithmetic, Andrew. Anxious Andrew, you don't know my dad, miss. Of what? Well, she does, if uh, his dad picks him up. Miss Battleaxe, if you add 26 and 301, then double it and divide it by 6, what do you get? Harry Henry, the wrong answer. Why were the max, maths books puzzled? Because they had a lot of questions. Yeah, you'll always be puzzled if you have a lot of questions that you need to answer and it's really hard so why was zero punished because he was naughty huh naughty naughty i don't understand what your joke is so moving on miss battleaxe how can you make so many mistakes in one maths class because i get here early oh maybe it's because uh, she starts the questions earlier before Miss Battleaxe s explains it. Maybe. What kind of what kind of tree is good at maths? A uh, geometry. It's your oh, ge geometry. Okay. It's because a tree. If it's called that, it's like very good. That's what geometry means. Ribbiting test. Hurry, Tony, I don't think I deserve zero for this test. Miss Butter, I don't either, but it's the lowest I can give. Why do you guys think he didn't deserve zero for the test? Maybe he done some extras? Or maybe he just... Just look at it. Look. Look at it. How does he think... How does... How do you or Miss Battleax think that he doesn't deserve zero? Maybe he answered some like one plus one, put them together 11 or something like that. 
six six minus three. He done it correct. If it was plus, he he would get the correct answer, but no. How did the dinosaur pass the exam with extinction? It does not really. I don't understand. Dad, were your test results good? Or tell me yes and no. Dad, what do you mean yes and no? Hoi tell me yes, my test results were no good. He doesn't need to say that he said no, my results weren't good. But he just said in a complicated way. Brainy Brian, let's have a way to say our tables. Clever Claire, our tables, I win. Yeah, because she said it first. But I don't think that's fair because Brainy Brian didn't even say three, two, one, go or something. Mum, all your teachers are giving you a bad report. Tell me, what have you been doing? Nothing, Mum. Well, you would get a bad report if you've been doing. Literally nothing because no math, no study, no literally doing nothing. It's like your statue. You're talking one maybe dracula's school report it's just like cultural transylvania reading better in the dark writing upside down cricket Charles promise as a bat what do birds get halloween trick or tweet or like trick or treat but trick or tweet it's it's a bit similar why do witches all look the same so you can't tell which is which oh wait guys can you spot one of the mistakes in which and which the h is missing here but the h is here and there like a witch like a real witch and which which one is it it's like yeah what kind of monster has the best hearing the eeriest yeah, because he has, it's like he has lots of ears. Did you hear about a vampire who needed a drink? He was bloodthirsty. Oh, yeah, it's like if your mouth is watering when, when you like something, but, but it's like vampires is dr dropping blood when, they're, when they like something. Okay. Knock, knock. Who's there? Even, even who? Even to suck your blood. Why do vampires like thick books? They like stories that they can get really, that can really get their teeth into. Oh, I think it means like very thick. If it's very thick, they can get like a thick person. They can get more blood out of it. What, uh, what goes flap, flap, bite, bite, ouch, ouch. Dracula. With a two, with a two feet. Maybe he's flapping, and then look. So this is the human. This is Dracula. He flaps, bites, and his teeth hurts. Would you call a witch's garage a broom cupboard? What was the name of the little witch's brother? He was called Ron. Called Ron. Spot the mistake. This one. Have you found it? So the 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 mistake is the A C A U L D C E O U L D. Cool. How many witches does it take to change a white bulb? Only one, but she changes it into a toad. Yeah, which which is like which is turn everything into princess toad kiss back to normal. Ghostly giggle. Why did the mother ghost say to the naughty baby ghost, "Don't spook until you spook into"? Or it's like, "Don't speak until you're spoken to." What do you get if you cross a ghost with a pack of grey? Snacks that go crunch in the night. Why can't ghosts tell fibs? Because you can see right through them. What do you get if you cross a footballer with a ghost? A goalie. 
I don't know how to pronounce it, but look. Goli, but it has the extra H and maybe other extra words. Knock, knock. Who's there? Oh. I mean, Harry Tenney went to a Halloween party with a sheet on his head. Are you a ghost? Asked Rudolph. No, I'm an unmade bed. What's a baby girl's favorite game? Peek a boo. All that. It's like this. Like, if they. It's like if you turn invisible, if you cover your face, they go boo. It's like that. Why was the bowl of soup so scary? It was screamed of tomato. Maybe this means cream with tomato or something. How do monsters count to 23 on their fingers? They can count to 23 because monsters have like, if, for example, if they have about, I don't know, like let's say about maybe five hands with five fingers on it, that would make up to 25. Or two, or, or one. Okay. Dizzy Dave, my bike's haunted. Hi, Tony, how do you know? Because they've got spooks on the wheels. Maybe it means like uh, spider webs. Because spider webs, if something has spider webs, it's always spooky. And it's stuck. So, here we are. Knock, knock. Winter's coming. That's for winter. I hope you like the Halloween special. So, winter is coming soon in two months. So, bye and have a happy Halloween.